seriously gonna blow up your miner? Rocket launcher. Don't blow up your miner. Alright, are you prepared? I thought you wouldn't blow I'm up your miner. to rocket launcher. No, don't blow up your miner. Firing missiles! Oh, they're out of ammunition. You didn't load them, did you? No. <laughs> yeah, what the... <laughs> okay, I was I told you I need a bulletproof glass for the cockpit. <laughs> you maniac! <laughs> I didn't realize I was inside the shield when I shot it. Grrr. Apparently, if you're inside the bubble, you can do damage. You, your cockpit's a fighter cockpit, isn't it? Yeah. All right, I'll bring the parts. To fix it. Well, you did blow it up. Well, I did mean to. I know that doesn't really excuse me, but I genuinely didn't mean to. Yeah, unlikely story. Well, I want your fighter to actually work. Because you've kind of got the only thing that might be able to fight the enemy. I don't know, I've been doing an alright job fighting off the enemies. Really? I said alright, I didn't say perfect. <laughs> okay, fair enough. How do you... Oh, I think you need more thrusters. And did you mean to make them asymmetrical? Yes. Um, you need more thrusters. Because it is struggling to stay up right now. It is? Yeah, it's at its almost at its limit of thrust. How can you tell? Because of how long the plumes on the thrusters are. Oh. So you need more. Well... Which that... means you'll probably need another battery. So you think I should scrap this whole thing and start all over again? No, you could extend the rear so that you get that extra space you need. Not easily. And mm. it'll make it look all wonky. It's fine as it is. No. Why don't you just cut out some spots in it like if you grind out some of those spots in the bottom what's actually underneath there don't try and cook my face so you're the one flying into my thrusters where is that thruster oh that's one of the side ones i see yeah that's all the space that there is down there unless i remove the landing gear yeah i'd get rid of the landing gear which might be a good idea anyway uh, since it's too close to the jets. I might put a landing gear on the back so I can... Yeah, lock on. Yeah. You could also, if you move the two thrusters, the two upper ones, out a block, you could probably put another one above it and then kind of pipe up the reactors instead. Well, I, I don't want to do that. Why not? Because then you could add more reactors and get more power. That's what I was thinking. Well, they're just there to charge the batteries. Yeah, but if you get enough reactors, then the batteries are just there for boost. The batteries aren't there for regular flight. It's just meant to be a little ship. It's not meant to be the Titanic. No, it's a fighter, which means it needs to be agile, which means it needs to have more thrust than it need. It should have more thrust than it just barely needs. It should have excess. Uh, I put two of those facing rearward instead of downward two last ones because I suspect if you choose to pitch up when you're about to smack into the ground you're going to pitch up rather than staying level would that be accurate I don't know <laughs> how upset would you be if I tried to rework Very... there's one spot I don't think you'll be upset by <sighs> you know you say that kind of thing a lot you're never correct. Can I show you what I'm thinking you could do? Unfortunately, you will have to get rid of your light temporarily. What? It's only temporary. It's a load-bearing light. It's not. Lights can't be load-bearing. I was thinking instead of the armor block that's behind the shield emitter, put another reactor in there. That way you'll get an extra reactor on. Well, I, I put the light there and I left a gap so that I can see the charge of the battery and I can access it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not going to go where the light is. It's going to, uh, so it's not going to block that at all. Yeah. Shall, shall I show you? Oh, fine. Just ruin everything. This armor block here. What? So the reactor goes there. Oh. Well, yeah? I guess that sort of works. It's mostly hidden, but it gives you just a tiny bit more power. Because you don't actually need a whole lot of power on the moon. But I just figure the more... 
Basically, you have the only shielded ship. I want to make sure it's as good as it can possibly be. I like the style. It's totally nothing I would have come up with, and I quite like that aspect of it. So I just wanted to try and help you get it functional as much as possible. Sorry. Yeah, stop flying into me. Sorry! <laughs> just trying to see if there were more bits I could do something with. Were you planning on putting extra rocket pods under the wings? Oh, it's just... I was going to do a weapons test and see how it goes. I was just going to leave them like that. But I guess I could You can put, put extra, extra Gatlings set. in. Wait, how do you load your Gatlings? Uh, they're piped to the cockpit. Oh, so you got to jump in, unload your ammo into the cockpit, and yeah. then they should load? Uh, speaking of which, I need to get some ammo. Um, go back. Yeah? You might have a first target. What? There's a Reva Harpoon Corvette out there. Well... Why is there... Why is there a screen in here that says, Oh, you suck? Uh, it's the official, unofficial, survival unlikely kill counter. Wow, that acronym worked out. <laughs> yeah. Well, there's too many numbers. <laughs> you know why there's lots of numbers on there, Capac? You know why? Because so many of them are your numbers. Alright, so you want me to go go fly out and kill something? If you feel you're ready. Because you always get upset with me for rushing you. Well, I usually just die. Have you set up your shields as you want them? What? Have you set up your shields? No. No, I had to set them up. Set well, them up how? You can set them up so that they don't destroy enemy grids if you happen to want to grip onto the enemy grid. Though you don't have any landing gear, do you? No. Okay, so that doesn't matter. So if you're running into an enemy grid, it's bad. It's just universally bad. Alrighty, so what are you going to go after? Are you going to go after the Reaver, or are you going to go... Okay, go get in some practice shots against this, uh... Horsefly drone? Yeah. Yeah, I guess you could. I can't even see the Reaver thing anymore, can you? I don't know, I'm concentrating on this Horsefly. Blam, 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 blam. Okay, I, I think you've tested your weapons. I don't think you need to shoot it anymore. We don't have that much ammunition. There you go. Weapons test successful. Uh, sure. You missed, but sure. What? Eh, it's in pieces. That means I won. Ah, something's shooting me. What? Where are you? Something on the ground is shooting me. At least we know your shield works. Did you see where the traces were coming from? Yeah, roughly. Are you heading towards it or away? I'm trying to come back around towards it. Ah, I see it. Ah! You know, you can't take that fire forever. You may want to actually shoot back. I can't. It's very hard to target in this thing. I've got no crosshairs. Can't see my lasers. Oh, you scored a hit! Scored a hit! It's still shooting though. Oh yeah, that worked. That was a direct hit with the missiles. Nice oh. shooting, Kabak. Uh, it doesn't look like there's much left. No, there is not. <laughs> I think that was part of a horsefly drone. I had the camera positioned perfectly as you hit it. Oh, it did... It did do three hexagons of damage to my shield. Okay. Whatever that means. Hey! I could possibly build a little fighter too, so we can go out and team up. So I could build something a bit heavier, you could be the more nimble one, and I'll be the one that kind of drags any prey that we capture down. Okay. Do you reckon? Once we get the sure. cockroach in? Oh dear. What have you done? There's an assailant. Oh. Oh, did you get too close to a raiding outpost? I think so. Uh... What should I do? Fight it! So it's heading toward you. Yeah. And what are you doing about that? Oh, I'm shooting it. You are not hitting it. Oh, you got some hits just then. You're too high. You may want to close in closer because you are missing a lot. Those missed. Yes, I can see that. <laughs> oh, there you go. That's some hits.
I think it's neutralized. You could try and grab its um, reactor before it hits the moon. Now its reactor's up the top. Yeah, I'm just making sure it's not going to explode or anything. Good call. Are you in zero, zero G? To... Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to crash down to the moon. That's why I was thinking you go for the power first. Oh, is this a large ship? Yeah. That's why I said get the reactor and get its uranium. If you weld it back up, you should just be able to take the uranium out. What? Do you like having a backseat driver? No. Also, <laughs> I can't see my ship anyway. I can. Um, whoa, 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 go back to the reactor and I can direct you from the reactor. Did you get all the uranium out? Yes. How come it's still on? Because it's still got a tiny fraction in it. Oh. Um, st stay still. Just tell me which way it's oriented keep... towards the enemy ship. So, from the enemy ship's orientation, if we assume that the thruster on fire is its top, and the reactor is forward, it is down 45 and right 30 degrees. So, planetward. Not moonward. Oh, I see. Well done. Your first victorious ship. Yes. Is there anything else worth salvaging on this thing? Well, any of it would be, but uh, I think it's time for us to get the cockroach. You don't think I should check out the dangerous encounter? No. No, I don't. There's another assailant coming in. Oh. Alright, I'm finding the cockroach. So I'll need some cover shortly. If you think, do you think you can provide it? I don't know. Not while this assailant's trying to eat me. Oh, the assailant's attacking the other ship. There's another ship. It's attacking the wreck. Oh, you should go in there. Oh. See what's going on. Oh, I took out its gun. The assailant's gun, or wait, there's the... something else off this way. There's another wreck out here. What? Okay, I took out the gun of the new assailant and now it's flying back to its base. Yeah, they'll do that. Um, There's something else over this way. I'll send you a GPS shortly. Right. It's just right, hovering I'm gonna there. I'm going to try to get out of range of this base. Oh, there you are. Can you see the thing? See, see what thing? Where? Hold still, hold still, hold still. Just hold position and I'll direct you. Can you see me? Yes. Look, look the direction I'm looking and you'll see it. It's just to the right of the Super Gremlin. Oh, I see it. If you go in first, we'll see if it's got active turrets and then I can sneak in and try and capture it. Uh, it looks like it's on fire. Well, that's a good sign. You're getting very close to that Super Gremlin, remember? Yeah. Oh. Uh, it's shooting at the Super Gremlin. We'll see if you can take out its turret now that you know where its turret is. Well, it's on the top. It's also very dark, I can't see it very well. Oh, it's another Reaver ship. I haven't taken any shots yet. There is a turret underneath and there's a turret on top. Assailant incoming. Oh, jeez. Three kilometers out. Yep, you took the turrets underneath, they're both on fire. Nice work. Okay, I got the top turret. Nice work. I think, I think I took out the turret on the assailant. Yeah, it's flying away. Well, I think it's all clear. Could still be an active turret somewhere. I'll do a victory lap and see if I can see any more guns. Uh, we are in gravity, so if we take the power out from this thing, it's gonna fall. Oh, oh dear. What's wrong? There's a kamikaze drone. Where? How far? Uh, three, three and point... a half. Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm getting out of the rack. Hopefully it's not going after the cockpit that I just Maybe I'll grind it down. Yeah, the it and the assailant are both coming in. Can you go for the can you go to shoot the kamikaze drone? Yeah. Okay, I took out the one thing I owned on the ship. Oh no, I own the container. Oh, that assailant's getting real close. It's one kilometer out. I'm diving down to the planet because I am not able to Whoa! The space pirate assailant, assailant's shooting the ship. Yep. You 
got lamps. I took out the assailant's gun. Okay. I'm going to try and grind down the assailant's reactor. See if I can capture... Whoops. Do not want to turn off my jetpack. Give me right, relative I'll dampening. see if I can get the kamikaze. He's a slippery fish. Ooh. 20 uranium. Nice. I did not, however, make a GPS where that wreck is. Oh, that kamikaze got real close. To the rack. To me. Oh. Oh, wait. There it is. I can see it against the planet. Oh! What happened? Go back! Holy moly! Go back! What happened? Uh, it just ran into me. The kamikaze drone? Yep. Did you survive? Yes. You Somehow. Sh your shields are slightly intact? Uh, my shields are almost fully intact. Oh. That's lucky. Alright, I'm back. Excellent. Just in time. Oh no! It's falling! What? The, the wreck, it's falling! Oh well, not much I can do about that. There's not much I can do about it either. Ah, oh, it ran out of hydrogen, I think. Wait a sec, what if I do this? Oop, that's not what I want to do. Did you just turn all its thrusters off? No, it ran out of hydrogen. Let's see if this impact buffer makes any difference. Oh. Jeez, I gotta get out of the way. Oh, I think that assailant is coming for you too. Well, help me! I can't do much against it. Yeah, yeah, I'm going for it. Well, some of the wreck's intact. Oh man, I'm in a very poor foxhole. Oh, I think the sound's going down. I don't think it can withstand the gravity here. Yep. <laughs> it is down. It hit hard. Might be something worth salvaging off it. Uh. There's stuff worth salvaging off this thing. Yeah, the assailant came down in the next crater over. Oh, do you want to mark the assailant and I'll mark this? Alright, once you've marked it, I think we should go collect the cockroach. Hello, my pretty. Alright, guess I'll head home then. Uh, you weren't going to run escort duty for me? What? Oh, you're doing that now. Yeah. Alrighty, are you ready to... um? Deal with the assailant that's coming in? Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Lift off! I mean, I'm pretty sure I can handle an assailant, but let's not test it when you've got something that's proving to be quite capable. I'm quite impressed, Gabak. Yeah, well, don't speak too soon. <laughs> Why is it whenever I give you a compliment, you get all... Oh no, things aren't going to go well. But when I give you, it, when I insult you, you're like, "No, I'm the best in the world." You just want to be contrary to me it's all the time, don't you? Conflict equals drama. This is true. Conflict does equal drama. Oh, there's the hole. Jeez, it looks like a empty grave. Yep, cockroach grave. No, let's really hope it's not a cockroach grave. Uh, I need to get back to base. You about to run out of power? About to run out of oxygen. Oh. Well, if you land, you can then provide me uh, some guidance to make sure I don't smack into something that I shouldn't. Uh. Okay. Great. Um. Because I might be a little tight on here. Where's the base? Remind me again why we put a long tail on this thing. Oh, jeez, this is not good. This is very bad. Are you about to suffocate? Yes. Oh, make sure your GPS... Oh, wait, your body will tell you where your body's at. You've got a manga. That's... Ah! Okay, I think this hole <sighs> is a little too tight. Yeah, I've got much bigger problems. You mean than the cockroach getting jammed in a hole again? Yes. 
How so? Well, there were multiple ships coming in. There are? I can't see them. There's a... I don't know, I can't see. The Hoban Tide should just go straight past. Oh man, this is such a tight squeeze. What are you up to at the moment? Nothing good. But, but, but what is it? I don't know what's going on and I can't really stop doing what I'm doing to try and help you. I've lost my ship. You what? How did you lose your ship? Well, I was going to die. Yeah, yes. So I went back to the base to get some oxygen. And you didn't mark where your ship was? Didn't have time. Well, that's a rather inauspicious way to lose your ship. Do you remember oh, roughly? I mean, it should still be fine. Yeah, for a few hours. So we're going to have to do a search for it. Well, what do you think I'm doing right now? Well, if you help me get the cockroach in, and you have a rough, and you make a marker roughly where you think you left it, then I can come and help. But right now, I'm much more worried about losing the cockroach than I am about your little ship. So if you could come help, so that we can get this thing inside, that would be good. I've only got 18% fuel left. Uh, okay. 17. Do you want me to get some ice then? Um, no, no, no. What I want, what you can do, if you can, is if you can quickly build. Well, just tell me if I'm clear. If I can get close to the bottom, then we can just build a platform. I can lock on with the landing gear, and then we can refuel this. At least if it's deep in a hole, it's less likely to get targeted. Uh, it's very hard to see. I think it's rear right at mo thruster is where I'm going to hit. Yep. Uh, the tail's very close as well. Yeah. Um, damn. Let's just get something under a landing gear. Okay. Fuel saved. Let's clear out the stuff we need, and then we should be able to get down. Oh, this is <laughs> this is stressful. <laughs> I really thought I had measured it out properly. I knew I would be tight, but I thought I'd still make it. If I can get it down to the bottom, we can try and get a connector on top, and then I can bring out the mining ship and try and refuel it, because I think refueling the cockroach by hand is just not an option. Uh, the tail is very close to the wall. That's better. 12%. <gasps> well. 10%. Can I go down? I don't know. What? You're supposed to be my eyes. Yeah, probably, now that that thruster is gone. What am I hitting? Am I hitting scaffolding? I don't know. Come back! <laughs> I can't see underneath the ship! Yes, you've landed on a scaffold. Can you please grind it down before I crash to the ground? <laughs> yes. Why is it the random scaffold here? Because I forgot to clear it out. Can I go down? Yep. Got 9% left. I mean, as far as I know, there's no more random scaffolds. Uh, I really can't see anything at the moment. Yeah, yeah. We might uh, start uh, sort of nosing forward and right. 8%. Am I clear on right, the roof? I think you're clear. If you come down a little bit further... Yeah, you should be good to just bring it in now. I can't see anything. Totally blind. You are 100% my eyes. Oh. Yep. Keep br keep bringing it down. Okay, forward a little. Okay, you're down. Yeah, I lost thrust. Um. Uh. Well, you destroyed it's... the landing gear that's in contact with the ground. Well, it's stuck. I I can't move. I'm completely stranded here. Well. Because uh, we lost hydrogen from one side of the ship. We've lost another Atmo thruster on this side. Yeah, I lost all the hydrogen from the right-hand side of the ship, so I lost power and I wasn't able to stay up. I don't have anything to build anything. There we go. I can lock with that landing gear. We are exposed in this position. 
well, start working on fixing it and refueling it. Yep. I mean, the gun should give it a fair amount of coverage. How exposed is it from the top end? Oh geez, there's scaffolding in front that I hadn't cleared out. Oh man, I really didn't prep for this properly. That's 100% my doing. Uh, I mean, something would have to be directly above to shoot it, but like three quarters of it is exposed if something's directly above. Okay, so if I get repairs done and I get refueled, I should be able to get it inside, hopefully. Dang it! So close! <laughs> oh. oh no! <sighs> okay, we gotta find your thing. Have you sent me a GPS for roughly where it is? It was somewhere, but I was heading back from the roach hole towards the base. So it's somewhere out that way. <sighs> Did you find it? Yep. Oh, really? How'd you find it? Uh, I think something tried to blow it up with a missile. Oh, when the shield shone and then you saw the shield. Uh, I saw the explosion. Ah. Oh, I think I see you. You going after the assailant? Well, it's coming after me, so that only seemed fair. Careful you don't hit me, I'm very nearby. What? Okay, it's taken down. You take, you've disarmed it. I'm grabbing its uranium. So where's the perch for your new ship, Kapak? Yeah, it's just in one of the craters over there. I mean one of the ones that has a clean shot from the sky? Yeah. <laughs> so you'll have to run to it under fire. Something like that. Oh. I feel like you did a pretty good job. Are you grinding down your little platform? No, I'm doing some modifications. Well, do you want to continue those next time? Sure. Because I think we've had a... Well, you've had a really successful day and I've had an... Well, disastrous day is probably about right. Considering the cockroach is now wedged in the hangar hole and I can't get, out, get it out until I repair it and refuel it. Which is awesome. Good job. Yeah, thanks. What's your what's your fighter gonna be called? Um What? This one or the other one? The other one. The other one is called the Fightertron. Did you add to the OU suck board today? No. Really? Uh don't think I died today. Did I? <laughs> I don't know. Serious trauma to the brain can cause uh, amnesia. <laughs> yep. Well, hop in your cryopod, because that's all we got time for. The next time, Capac hopefully won't outperform me again, because that's just weird. So there's all that and plenty more to come, and we will see you then. See you later, everyone. <laughs>